As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Harry takes a spear from inside the cornucopia. Jimmy T grabs a jar of fishing bait while Colonel Sanders gets fishing gear. Eggie, Bishop, and Juan work together to get as many supplies as possible. Juice grabs a shield leading on the cornucopia. Crazy Dave fires a bag full of explosives. Hobbat Dummy runs away from the cornucopia. Simon, Kesh, Chicken Sandwich, and Chris Pratt share everything they gathered before running. Pichu rips a mace out of Mr. Feast's hands. Oh, Mr. Feast, you're really weak. Suitcase runs away from the cornucopia. Hinata runs away from the cornucopia. Gelatin retrieves a trident from inside the cornucopia. Anvil catches Eric off guard and kills him. <laughs> Holy crap, that's our first kill. <laughs> Eric, what the heck, man? I thought he would actually win this. Charlie runs away from the cornucopia. Tony Eagle Eye sets Al on fire with a Molotov. Pierre finds a bag full of explosives. Bishop camouflages himself in the bushes. Anvil dies from thirst. Like, bro was literally Eric's biggest op, and after he killed him, like, decides to die peacefully. Charlie and Hinata fight one and parry. Charlie and Hinata survive. Wait, that, that means... No! Why did one have to die, bro? Chris Pratt makes a wooden spear. Cash travels to higher ground. Ow. Oh no! I'm literally about to hit a cliff! I do not care! Simon constructs a shack. Tony Eagle Eye searches for firewood. Gelatin receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Combat Dummy discovers a cave. We got a whole squad here. Pichu, Mr. Feast, Pear, Eggy, and Crazy Dave hunt for other tributes. Chicken Sandwich tends to juice wounds. Jimmy T receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. And Colonel Sanders defeats Suitcase in the fight, but spares her life. Five cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Eric Animations, District 11. Al McQuiggan. District 11, that's District 11 gone, first round. Anvil from Minecraft, District 9, 1, District 3, and Perry, District 10. Eggy, Tony Eagle Eyes, and Perry discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Chicken Sandwich loses sight of where he is. Gelatin sees fiery. Gelatin sees a fire, but stays hidden. Chris Pratt tries to free this affection. Hinata destroys Colonel Sanders' supplies while he is asleep. Charlie sets Bishop on fire with a Molotov. Cash and Suitcase talk about the tributes still alive. That's nice. At least they're bonding. Juice, Jimmy T, and Mr. Feast start fighting, but Jimmy T gets away just as Juice kills Mr. Feast. Damn. Combat W thinks about winning. As if. Simon receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Crazy Dave sees a fire, but stays hidden. Pichu tends to his wounds. Tony Eagle Eyes travels to higher ground. Pichu diverts suitcase attention and runs away. Chris Pratt runs away from Eggy. Chicken Sandwich chases Colonel Sanders. Kinda ironic. Juice goes hunting. Crazy Dave attacks Cash, but he manages to escape. Jimmy T fishes. Hinata receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Simon bashes combat from his head in with a mace. Pear receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Shelton fishes. Charlie unknowingly eats toxic berries. Used his pummel to the ground and killed by a troop of monkey mutts. Eggy uses Jimmy T as a shield for the monkey mutts. Pear survives. Suitcase injures Cash and leaves him for the monkey mutts. Crazy Dave uses Chicken Sandwich as a shield for the monkey mutts. Bro is built different. Tony Eagle Eyes injures Chris Pratt and leaves him for the monkey mutts. Gelatin survives. Colonel Sanders dies from internal bleeding caused by a monkey mutt. Pichu dies from internal bleeding caused by a monkey mutt. Simon survives. Hinata survives. A grand total of 11 cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Bishop, District 9. Mr. Feast, District 5. Combat Dummy, District 7. Charlie, District 12. Juice, District 2. Jimmy T, District 4. Cash, District 1. Chicken Sandwich, District 10. Chris Pratt, District 1. Colonel Sanders, District 8. P2, District 6. From that massacre, left only 8 people left. So if your character is still alive, then congrats on making it this far. Well, never mind. To anyone who bet on gelatin, Eggy tracked him down and killed him. Suitcase receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Tony Eagle Eye sees a fire but stays hidden. 
Kanata and Crazy Dave would sleep in shifts. Not to do all I was expecting. Pierre tries to sing himself to sleep. Simon receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and memoirs from the tribute families. Simon decides not to go to the feast. Tony Eagle Eyes pushes suitcase off a cliff during a knife fight. Hinata decides not to go to the feast. Eggy kills Pierre for his supplies. Crazy Dave falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Hinata receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Tony Eagle Eyes tries to sleep through the entire day. Time receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Eggy goes hunting. Four cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Jelton, District 6. Suitcase, District 12. Pierre, District 8. Crazy Dave, District 5. Simon cooks his food before putting his fire out. Again, Tony Eagle Eyes huddled for warmth. Hinata tries to treat his infection. Hinata scares Simon off. Eggie dies from thirst. Tony Eagle Eyes receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance. Eggie from District 3. Which leaves us to our final three. Tony Eagle Eyes is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Hinata and Simon tell stories about themselves to each other. Simon camouflages himself in the bushes. Hinata goes hunting. Tony Eagle Eyes dies from thirst. Why are most of the characters dying of thirst? Arena event. Carnivorous squirrels start attacking the tribute. Two cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Tony Eagle Eyes, District 2. Simon the Chipmunk, District 7. Which means the winner is none other than Hideki Hinata from District 4.